Anger was boiling over at Regina City Hall as police moved in, telling residents they need to be gone by the weekend. The move caps off a few frantic days in Regina politics. Mayor Sandra Masters called a special council meeting about the camp with less than 24 hours notice. But the meeting was canceled before it began. Many councillors are on vacation and couldn't make it. At least three councillors found out about all of these developments through the media. Andrew Stevens was one of them. Bringing, bringing us to here I think is bullshit. A morning tent fire is what caused the fire department to order the people here to leave under the Fire Safety Act. Effective immediately they need to start collecting their belongings and vacating the, the property. And if they don't, we, uh, we have plans to clean up the property. City Hall will be closed to the public while the camp is decommissioned. As far as my perspective is concerned, uh, Chief Jackson and the entire Fire and Protective Services who have been on site every day, um, every day since the camp started um, and responding to issues, um, they have my full support. As Masters spoke to the media inside Thursday afternoon, police serve notices outside. It's left a sour taste in the mouths of volunteers and residents. We were told we have to leave immediately with, and when we asked where we're going to send people or what, who is going to come and help connect these folks to housing and to different services, they had no idea. They said that's not our job, that's social services supposed to do it, the government is supposed to do it, which is understandable. But this was clearly so poorly thought out. Some residents say they have no plans to leave and volunteers say they'll stand with them which means, despite the notices, this dispute here at City Hall isn't over. Alexander Kwan, CBC News, Regina.